came out with my first hot stuff. You're welcome back to some more Pikmin series challenge mode and watch this episode. We did this, 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 and down to the Smurge Castle in this episode. We need a hurry up because we need to get a move on in this place. Fossil beetles everywhere, so you want to be careful. You're going to have to be careful. Also, the bomb rocks can kill the mom. They won't, they won't, they will not kill the babies. So don't worry. Wait, I was gonna say they killed all the babies. I was gonna say it shouldn't kill all the babies, but just in case. Be careful. But it didn't kill all the babies, so we're good. Also, there is a glint beetle on this floor that has a treasure. So we're gonna need to look out for that. So just look out for falling bomb rocks everywhere. I did see where one of the treasures was, so we should be completely fine. Got through this place without having to go through what it is I was actually really worried about. That's completely fine. And we got through this place without seeing like a single nectar. Is that normal? Because that shouldn't be normal. Drone supplies. Oh well there's an egg right there. We're gonna use that really quick. I'm surprised I've only lost eight Pikmin in here so far. I'm actually really proud of myself for that too. I believe they are all blues also, so we should have 52 blues and uh, 40 boltmen. Now uh, one nectar came. Most of them got on there. We got everyone except one little boltman. Yeah, we should be fine though. Two minutes of spare. Oh, of course, it had to be a purple potion. The one time I didn't want to go in, the one time I ended up getting one. Why did they go this way? I would have been safe and just went around. We could pick them, but of course. Just making sure the glint beetle wouldn't spawn back there. They're everywhere on this floor. Oh god. That scared me. That really scared me. <laughs> Alright, Proton AA. Would you come over here, Pikmin? Before you all die. What? What? Did we get the treasure from the glint beetle? Did we get the treasure from the glint beetle? I don't remember getting the treasure from the glint beetle, but... Was that the first treasure we got? Maybe it was? I think that was the first treasure on this floor that we got. Unless this game is glitching out, it better not be. Well, I guess we'll see if this game is um, trying to trick my mind. No, I don't think it is. I think there is only 665 Pocos in here. I thought it was 670, but I don't think there is a treasure that's literally worth 5 Pocos. I don't think. I don't think the glint beetle would give you that, but I mean, possibly we have all the treasures. Hopefully we do, because I'm moving on. I want to get out of this death trap. 
And we made it through without triggering the thing I was so scared of. Which is the boss of this place. And also the reason why we need purples. We've got plenty of purples when we get in this floor. No, we don't want to open this one yet. It'd be terrible if we did. Actually, I have no idea how terrible it would be, but... We're gonna want to waste our Boldman because... They're not gonna be able to go back up there with us. I feel bad that the bull man can't the bull man, the bull man can't come back up with us, but that's the sad truth. Hopefully we won't lose any Pikmin in this fight. This fight is really easy, so I wouldn't worry about losing too many Pikmin, or any Pikmin at all. Honestly, I think it would be the best if um, I kept the captain back here with all of the Pikmin and just had the purples go forth. Because the other Pikmin really can't do too much to this boss. They really can't. So we're just going to uh, flower up everyone. You know what, we're gonna use everyone. Why not? I was gonna say throw Pikmin at the egg, but no. Beat the water race. One of the most deadliest enemies in the game. He's completely harmless without his rollers, by the way, which is what'll happen when his health hits zero. And there goes two of my purples, or one. That's fine, I'm fine still. Got this. Still got this. And he's dead. No more Pikmin can die. But even the music has no idea what it needs to do. Got some weird fat chicken thing. He's scared of the photo of purple rollers. His rollers are an instant kill, which is the bad thing about this whole place, but obviously we never had to deal with him. Processing. How curious. The wraith completely vanished. But what was it? The surface object scans indicate the presence of a bright red component. We're gonna, we're gonna flower up with these really quick. I do like to have at least all flowers by the time we get out of here. It's just too bad one purple had to die of all things. Couldn't have been a Boldman, but... Because I don't... Do Boldman actually count as Pikmin death? I don't think they do. I don't know. Because they don't really appear as a Pikmin in your squad. Like right now it says I have 61 Pikmin. You know, very clearly have 91. Pokos for this professional noisemaker. 
How insulting. This object's coloring is more eye-catching than my own hole. I shall connect it to the alarm clock in our esteemed president was so fond of. Processing complete. I had refitted both objects into a lock of phone. So now you can call your Pikmin and they will get plucked. But it's time to go. Now prepare for a bunch of cutscenes. Goodbye, Boldman. I hope you guys will somehow survive in this death trap. I wish they could just convert to like random Pikmin colors that you want, but obviously that can't be the case. I'd definitely choose more pur well, maybe not more purples, I'd probably choose more reds and blues. You've repaid the entire debt! Like, I don't understand the silent B in there, but... Mission complete. You've earned 10,000 pogos. Now, Hokkaito Freight will be prosperous and debt free until the end of time. Probably. Prepare for blast off. We return to Hokkaito triumphantly. And the president is like crying or something. I can't even tell. But we got out of Earth. So it looks really toxic, by the way. Also, maybe seeing someone missing from this cutscene. And I like how it only shows the complete body of the legs. Then it just shows the face of everything else. But there is no Louie. You forgot him. Story continued. <laughs> no, we we will come back here because I don't really want Pikmin series redo to be fifty episodes long. We still have a whole five more dungeons to get through. I think we got one in the Awakening Wood, one in the Perplexing Pool, and we have an entire area that we haven't been to yet. I also like the graphics here. It looks pretty nice. And uh, these are the credits, which means it's, it's technically the end of the game, but you can still come back and save Louie, which is what I would consider the real end to the game. This is an end. I mean, it would be cool if Pikmin 3 was coming back to get Louie, but like if um, Pikmin 3, like the final boss in Pikmin 2 was the Water Wraith, and, like, the Water Wraith had its own little area or something, and then uh, every other dungeon I've been to so far would have been required to complete in the debt. And all the treasures would be required, all adding up to the 10,000. And then Pikmin 3 would be getting back Louie, which would be going through another adventure, maybe a little bit smaller of a game, but I don't even think that would be a good idea. But that could be the way they made Pikmin 2, having 201 treasures and being way more than 10,000 Pokos. I don't know. And then Pikmin 4 could be the original Pikmin 3. But I like how Pikmin 2 has like two parts to the story. Pikmin 1 is just getting ship parts and then fighting the final boss. Pikmin 2 was um, completing the debt and then the second part game back Louie. And I think Pikmin 3, there's a lot of parts to that story but I consider it just one part. So Pikmin lost in battle, 24. We only lost eight Pikmin in the submerged castle. Really proud of that. 
290 Pikmin board. Yeah, there was a time I went through 197. Time with Red Pikmin, I only went through with 10. Purple Pikmin born, 110. Total play time, 6.16. Not my fastest, but it wasn't really too far from being the fastest. Still proud of um, how far we've come with this redo let's play. Resume the expedition and return to the planet. Why not? Look, there is still more treasure. Right? If we looked at all, so I guess he would have wanted us to go back anyways. So even if we didn't lose Louis, we'd probably have to go back and get all the treasures, but. There's really no point unless you're dead. Unless we got one. See, we didn't even complete the submerged castle. We did not complete the submerged castle. Are you kidding me? You have got to kidding me. In the next episode, we are gonna keep going in the perplexing pool. We'll go back to the dreaded submerged castle. And get a little bit farther. I'll see you guys then.